The FDA has approved a new surgery for people with epilepsy, and SSM Health St. Louis University Hospital is planning the surgery on its first patient with epilepsy this month. Fox News' Dan Gray has that story in tonight's SSM Health Medical Minute. Deep brain stimulation has been used for years for those with Parkinson's. Now it's being expanded to help patients with epilepsy. Surgical trials in Europe have produced promising results. There was a multi-center study with many patients enrolled in it, and they found a remarkable reduction in seizure frequency on the order of around 60 to 70 percent with this technique. SLU care neurosurgeon Dr. Richard Buholz at SSM Health St. Louis University Hospital says two electrodes are implanted in the brain and a generator on the patient's chest is programmed to suppress the seizures. To me, it's really transformative. To me, it is indeed the future of neurosurgery. The reason being is that now, as we learn more about the brain and we learn how specific areas affect neurological activity, we can now go in and intervene very precisely into those areas and change things that are completely debilitating to our patients. For the SSM Health Medical Minute, I'm Dan Gray.